What up, what up, it's your boy AD and that's all day. I'm in the spot. What's happening, y'all? Back with some more MGTOW content in the spot, in the peace. Shouts out J Rob Beats for being up in here. You already know that's who on the beat. But yeah, man. Shouts out to the fathers, man. Father, happy Father's Day. I feel like they deserve it. You can tell I got my cup. Y'all know I'm a little turned right now, but I don't care. I'ma still come out here and say my real shit about fathers. And Father's Day. I feel like fathers deserve a lot more credit than what they actually do. I get pretty annoyed, honestly. Because it's true, man. Like, Mother's Day come around. I'm not saying that there ain't no good mothers, but... It's sad how Mother's Day come around and we just worship mothers and women for no reason. Like, it's sad. I see it all the time, man. I do. I mean, it's too many times where I know a woman that effed up and then done some fucked up shit relating to her and her kids and the way she went about her life. But motherfuckers come over there and celebrate her and worship her like she did the right thing. And I I don't agree with that shit. That's why I feel like men deserve more credit because a lot of men don't, I mean, a lot of people in general don't understand what men really go through when it comes to dating and and when it comes to who want them and who don't. You know, there's women out here who will get with a dude clearly for clout chasing or using them for some shit, right? Then not be happy because he don't want her because she ain't on nothing or on nothing for him. And to get mad and say some other shit. Try to have a baby by him. Do anything, man. For real. Have a baby by him. And then when you ain't there. Oh, oh, oh. He was this. He was that. When you was cloud chasing the whole time. So a lot of them, man. You know, every time fathers want to come up. Everybody want to diss them and talk shit about them. Not everybody. But you hear it a lot, man. Shit, Muzz already be telling me like, yeah, they out here on the online right now going in on fathers right now. I'm like, damn. I'm like, see y'all full of shit. And the men who co co signed it need to wake the fuck up and pay more attention to what's going on for you end up in some shit. Cause that's how you know something wrong when everybody try to blame it on the dude. You know, that's how you know something is going wrong when you can come up to pretty much any woman. Pretty much, right? It don't matter. And then ask them, hey, why you broke up with this dude? Why this dude with you? And they'll always say it's, some, it's his fault or it was some dumb shit. You'll never hear it was them. That's how you know it's something wrong and why fathers deserve more credit. Because that's like a real fact. Like, how many of them will really say it? And you know they undid something. Muzz ain't perfect. Muzz ain't perfect. That's why I say fathers deserve more credit. Because they not perfect. You know? We all make mistakes. But the question is, are we going to talk about them? Or are we going to stand up for ourselves and be honest about the mistakes we made so we can move on in the right direction? That's that's what I'm talking about. Because there's fathers out here that do take care of their kids. There's fathers out here that are single fathers. But you'll never hear no campaign going for single fathers, will you? Oh, but you'll hear single mom struggles till the day you die, right? But will you ever hear, oh, this father struggle hard? You see what I'm saying? It's all an agenda. It's trying to make one side look bad to try to make the other side look get, to look better. Instead of coming together and really being like, hey, this is what's going on. I mean, to just think about when Father's Day happens. It happens in the summertime when school is not going. During the time where a lot of TV shows and stuff aren't running either. So it doesn't get put on the spotlight like Mother's Day. Mother's Day come around. It's all known. School going on. All this shit going on in, in May. You know, bam. They both happen on Sundays, though. I damn near feel like rapping on this beat. This beat sound dope. But yeah, I'm just chilled out right now. Like I said, back with MGTOW content. And y'all know I will come with more MGTOW content. I don't care what anybody say. Y'all know I'm speaking that real. I'm saying real shit. Because it's true, man. Fathers do deserve blessings, man. 
Like, I talk about myself. Like, I took care of my daughter for two years on some circumstances. And I actually did. I had to, I basically raised my daughter for a good, strong two years every single day. And ain't nobody was like, hey, AD, up talking me, calling me father of the year. And I actually did a damn good job. Ooh, fireworks. People like fireworks. That's that noise. People like fireworks. For real. I mean, you had some people who wanted to come and do something for my daughter, little stuff, but nobody really wanted to do nothing for me. You know, it's so different with women. That's why fathers deserve more respect, because it's true. They don't get the same acknowledgement and appreciation as women. Like I said, you could be a messed up chick with kids. People think you did something. That's not right. I mean, and we already know it's not difficult. Like, a lot of these women, how they get pregnant, they just meet somebody who they want, who they probably want something from, and they just lay on their back and they just get it popping. And a lot, a lot of them hope they get pregnant. Like, I'm not lying. Like, when they find a dude they really like who got the money and who got shit and who they really into, they'll try their best to get pregnant. Is they ever going to tell you this shit? No. But it's true. Because they'll be worried about another bitch coming through trying to get it. Again, my bad. My bad. I know. I'm kind of turned. I know y'all like, why is he not reacting to that? Because I'm, I'm kind of turned right now, man. Off that kill bill, too. But... I'm just vibing with y'all. I miss my live streams. I do. They'll be back soon. Very soon. My live streams will be back definitely by next month. So, be ready for that. For real, man. Like, I had to come blow a square and tip a cut with y'all. I had to, man. Get back into my real vibes. I remember back in the day, that's all I used to do. But back to the subject, though. Hell yeah, man. They deserve more credit. Like I said, I did that mud still try to treat me like I'm a little kid. Like, uh, what? Huh? They won't even acknowledge when you do better. They won't even acknowledge. I swear if you a dude, they act like fucky. Some women use that to their advantage. That's another little secret that women like to do, but it's true. If they see a man who got, uh, like, who's single with kids, they kind of think, like, oh, that might be a man with money. Because that's what determines a lot of times if a man is going to get a child in a, you know, divorce or whatever, separation, whatever. It's about that man's status and it's about how bad the woman really is. But you know it's in her favor. So basically what I'm saying is, is that the woman could be messed up, but if the dude's funds ain't right, you might not get them anyways. But it'll be more in her favor where she could have less funds and they'll just come support her. This is real. That's why I say, if you don't got kids, definitely be careful. Even though I don't really advise this to be a time to want to have them. Right now, it's a lot going on. But if it, it is what it is, though, and if you got them, do the best you can with them. To educate them and do the best that you can for them, man. And speak to them if you can, you know. You know. I know it's not so easy when children are young. It's kind of difficult when children are a little young because they be young. But when they get older, I feel like it's a little better and easier to try to connect with them. Real talk, you know. So again, so I say all the fathers out here turn up much love. The good dads out here, the good ones, the ones that actually did some, the ones that don't get acknowledged, the ones that don't get spoken about. Cause I mean, shit, you got a lot of baby mothers out here that know they got good fathers and won't say it. I mean, for real. This is why they deserve more credit. I mean, it's true. It's like women will never tell you about their their shiftiness and the shit that they be on. That's the that's the killing part to me about women. Cause they'll do some shit that be way easier than what you think, and they act like it wasn't nothing, and they act like oh, it's just how it happened. When the whole time they was plotting and scheming for some money, plotting and scheming for some clout. I'm telling you. Then it don't work out because you was plotting this scheme and then all of a sudden now it's the man's fault. That's how it be, yo. I'm dead ass serious. Let me 
They know what they be on. That's why I shouldn't be as lighted. You should at least put the same light on Father's Day at least. But they don't want to put that light on there. Like, at least put that light on there at least. Like, hey, fathers, hey. But they ain't going to do that because they they are at a proper balance to life. And they don't want things to be balanced. They want things to be upside down, topsy-turvy. They want one end to be way off the fucking charts while the other end be over here. They don't want that shit. They want shit to be fucked up. That's why people need to pay attention to what the hell I'm talking about. Because it's, it's for real. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I know it's been a while since I made a mix out video, but I will do more. I don't give a shit. Shit, I'll make it, make another one at night turn. I don't give a fuck. Still spreading this knowledge. It is what it is. But I'm gonna let y'all later like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you think. Turn up to the fathers. Much love. I'm gonna upload this in the morning.